behind it. Yeah. Oh, the lights are off now. <laughs> Freaking one night in Paris. One night in Paris. Everybody trying to go, yeah, the party jumping off And we putting on a show, trying to catch a vibe Good morning, it is Sunday, we are going to get coffee But, Mr. Clout is here, the squirrel It's okay fella, don't be afraid <laughs> Somebody come get her We're at Alfred's and we are going to get some. Yeah, that is cool. Don't touch it. Don't even look at it. Go on, get. It's like the same Mercedes from uh, Hangover. But yeah, we're going to go get some coffee at Alfred's this morning and that farmer's market's going on that was going on last year or last time we were here. So, might even see that. The original but first coffee. They are closed to the public, so you got to order at a window and then wait out here like. In the dog kennel. <laughs> so we're waiting to be chosen. <laughs> Got myself. Oh my gosh, green sauce. Oh my gosh, a different color sauce. Oh boy. All right, here. Moment of truth here. Got the the Alfred burrito. Oh. Yeah. This is the smaller of the two burritos, but I didn't need nothing big. Just just a little bit. Just enough to wet my whistle this morning. But let's see it here. Oh, I should probably dip in this. I'll try it without the sauce because... I want to get the, the original flavor. Um, good? Yeah. It is really good. That's right with the green sauce. The green sauce, I bet, is really good. Oh my gosh, it kind of tastes like creamy jalapeno from uh, Chewy's in a way. Oh. Yeah, this is super good. What'd you get, Rochelle? Um, I got a lox bagel. Look at these hash browns. Those look so good. And the cold brew. And the cold brew. It sets off the perfect taste. Oh, wow. And then your bagel's here. <laughs> Everything bagel from Yeasty Boys with cream friche, cream cheese. That's 100% Philadelphia cream cheese, I could just tell. <laughs> we have never had boba tea before, so we are going to get it right here if they're open. Yo! Mm -mm. Did I stir it a little bit? Moment of truth. First time trying Boba Fett. Boba. You have to suck up the balls into your mouth. Did you? Yep. That's a taste I wasn't expecting. I was not expecting it to taste like this at all. It reminds me of something, but I can't think what it is. Boba's mud. It reminds me of Pledge Cleaner. <laughs> It reminds me of a cleaner. cleaner. No! Try this now. That should not taste like a pledge cleaner. <laughs> oh my god. Mmm. Pledge. It still mm. tastes like pledge? You know, actually, the coconut might be the way to go. I'll do. Pledge cleaner, coconut. Bad, it tastes. It's just more refreshing. Still coconut, though. Is it really? It's coconutty. So that was boba tea. We tried it. Would you get it again? Get a different flavor. I'd Plus. probably get coconut. We are finally at Aviator Nation. John, you built this. You put this place together. You go look inside. Yeah. It's like wraps around. She did all that. Uh huh. All of this. Like all 
the wood. Damn. And then that wall. And that's all there. Uh -huh. And this little like crazy entrance. How many days did you work out here? Um, oh wow. A couple, a couple months in all of this. That's awesome, man. Uh huh. I started in here, worked all the way out, and then I did like the bathrooms. You did? Uh huh. Did you do this? Yeah, I did hear this. <laughs> so like. They're bathrooms, they're not open right Oh, okay. They're cool. Yeah. Yeah. And I'll have a full on bar here once it's all opened. Coolest place to hang out. Dude, yeah. this is gonna be sweet. Yeah. I love the furniture, it's just like. Yeah, it's very 70s feel. Yeah. One piece of wood. They're not like pieced together, you know? Store so sick. I think that looked good on you. Are you gonna get it? Yeah. Oh. Alright dude, yeah, this is sick. You did good work, dude. Thank you. Awesome. Alright, well, we got some sick fits, brah. Alright, I'm making the switch. Take my hat off. Oh yeah. I feel like Johnny Drama who was all about trying to get that freaking hat on Entourage and I finally got it. Tracking it down. We have found our spot here in Malibu. What beach is this? Leo Carrillo. Leo Carrillo Beach here in Malibu. And we are just on the beach, just chilling. Look at the spread. What do we got here? We got some wings. We got Pokey, some sushi, seaweed salad, lots of chips, fresh sauces made in Long Beach. Oh yeah. We got the wings. And we got lots of beverages. beverages. Okay. I had to get some St. Archer because we can't get this at home so I always love getting it because love the company so yeah we are gonna um, just sit here honestly for a couple hours just chill hang out and uh, might play the drone or something I don't know I've never had pokey before this is goldfish you said yeah it's goldfish <laughs> okay <laughs> it's raw fish yeah bro it's nice huh no it's actually like really tasty okay yeah it's it actually tasty, is good. Buds. That's always my thing with like seafood is I like, can't really eat it raw. At least really? it, just the thought of it, just the thought of it. But and no. Then here's some seaweed salad. I'd pull a fish out of the ocean and Hell just fucking crunch yeah. on it. Yeah. You just, you do? He raw dogs the fish. Oh yeah, I tried the seaweed salad too and it was good. Okay. Yeah. Oh, this is kombucha. This is kombucha. Kombucha. Definitely a taste, yeah. Pass of a sea salt. These chips are so good. Okay, this salsa right here is so effing good. Lindsay and Jeff are gonna I took a picture of Oh my god. Oh. Tijuana Freddy's handmade salsa. Tijuana Freddy knows what is up. They will totally Instagram. Dude makes some salsa that slaps. <laughs>
gonna get a toast the Pacific. Where's the tide? Oh, that is freaking cold! Oh my god! Alright, that is cold. Later that same evening. Find it. Yeah. Oh, the lights are off now. <laughs> Freaking one night in Paris. One night in Paris. of dirty Vegas days go by. You found it! It was face up on a rock like this. Someone found it and put it on the rock. Somebody did find it? Yeah. Oh. Because it wouldn't have fallen on a rock like this. It was up on a rock like this. Thank goodness. Thank you. Alright, I didn't want to jinx anything, but she our... Found it. Yes. Things got... Our, our plans got changed and how we found out... Oh, the lights are off now. <laughs> The reason we found out plans change is because we went to El Coyote to give them our number to text us and Rochelle gave them their number and we couldn't find Rochelle's phone and we pinged it and it was <coughs> said it was back at the beach in Malibu where we were. We drove all the way back to Malibu and there listened was. and we listened to every rendition of Dirty Vegas Days Go By because <laughs> for some reason it kept freaking playing on repeat. We even heard an acoustic version. Alright, we're driving by Nobu right now because we saw TMZ and a bunch of paparazzi waiting. They're with a ladder too. So there's definitely a celeb inside of Nobu right now in Malibu. Coming up on Nobu here. The paparazzi's waiting. I didn't realize, but me and John are twinning in our aviators. I, we couldn't come out here and not get any aviator nation stuff, so we splurged a little today in Malibu. Who we yell at them? Who we got in there tonight? What's up? You asking? Yeah. Okay. Oh yeah. Who is yeah. it? Paris Hilton. Oh nice. Cool. All right. <laughs> yeah, we're from out of town, so it's like you know. It's over away. Oh yeah, where from? Nice. Oh, we're from Ohio. Oh, cool. So you're a little farther away. Yeah. All right, cool. <laughs> well, hope you see her. Yeah, I hope so too. We've been waiting for a while. <laughs> see ya. Yeah, we did. We asked the paparazzi and these two girls are sitting there. It's Paris Hilton in there. But <laughs> as we're like circling around, I feel like we're in Yellowstone. And like there's reported that <laughs> there's a grizzly bear on the it's side of the road. Sighting. So we like whipped around and then I just straight up asked those two people that were waiting to take pictures. But... Yeah, uh, it was Paris Hilton, Simple Life, one of my favorite shows ever. It was great, well done. I love that they asked what Walmart was. That was like, so cool. Freaking, I wanted to eat at um, um, Broad Street Oyster Co. earlier today to get some freaking caviar, and she ate at Blue, she, I can't even say the name. She ate there a few hours ago. She we ate there and said the freaking her. caviar and fries were bomb today, and we did not go because we wanted, we were fighting. You wanted Chipotle. Chipotle. <laughs> Well, we didn't get Chipotle Celebrities either, but, don't go to Chipotle. but we would have missed it. And anyways, and then she's also wearing the outfit out. Freaking just Abby just bought a new aviator it's outfit. It's the blue, just like that. And Paris Hilton bought it. So guys, Abby's got good taste. But Aviator Nation. I can't believe that. Well, hey, we got the we. She says I'm obsessed with these looks. Well, <laughs> we Abby is rocking the same Paris Hilton look. Yeah. It's just too bad we didn't have a night in Paris because we could have had a freaking one night in Paris! We didn't make it here last night because we got back from Joshua Tree so late and El Coyote didn't work out tonight so we were trying Dave's hot chicken tonight. Rochelle says it's great. I bet it's awesome. Abby was sleeping. Just woke up. Alright, we got the chicken here. We got the mac and cheese. Looks like they... I don't know. Oh, the battery's about to die. Shit. Alright, alright, alright. We got, we got two of the same things here. Oh, look at that. We 
got a slider and a tender combo. She's glistening. This looks amazing. I don't know which. I got extra hot and Abby got mild, so I'm not sure which is which, but Abby will find out if she gets the wrong one. <laughs> I'm gonna give a tender a whirl. Just, just look at this. This ain't your average Tyson chicken stir. This looks amazing. It be slapping? Oh, you can feel the heat instantly. I can feel the heat coming. It's really good though. Mm. I really like this. Yeah, it's very good. Alright, now Abby is going to try her slider. Attention customer, Marcadio and Brian will be closing in 15 minutes. Alright. Is it good? Yeah. Right, how's yours, Michelle? Is it amazing? We still haven't tried the mac and cheese yet. Who wants to dive in first on that? Oh, you. It looks like Stouffer's. It's pretty good. It might just be like, I don't know. It's pretty good, but I mean, it's definitely good. It's not as creamy as I was hoping, but it's still, I still don't think it tastes very good. All right, so just based on the first couple bites, I would say that it's it's very, very, it's super freaking good. Is it Hattie, Hattie B's good? Not Hattie B's. But it's still freaking yeah. very, very good. So. Uh, yeah, I'll definitely like to hit this up again, but uh, this will be it for today's vlog. So if you like it, hit that thumbs up, hit that subscribe button, leave a comment below. Let me know if you like hot chicken and if you would try this. Ladies on the menu. <laughs> Ball with the floor to make the bank. Diggy, 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 send the boogies up.